নমস্কার আসসালামু আলাইকুম সস্ত্রিয়াকাল মই মিশখা আপোনালোকে সকে ভাবিছে পলাক কলৈ গল ওয়েল পলাক কোত আছে আৰু কলৈ গল হেতু কোৱাৰ আগতে এটা বেকগ্ৰাউণ্ড স্কোৰ এটা দি লওঁ নহয়নে ওয়েল মই সদায় কওঁ আৰু হেতু কথা মই সদায় কৈও থাকি নিম প্ৰায় মই অসমীয়া চলচিত্ৰৰ লগত যেতিয়া জড়িত আছিল চিনেমা চিৰিয়েল ফেশ্বন ইণ্ডাষ্ট্ৰি সকলোৰে অসমৰ সকলো মানুহৰ পৰা বহুত বেছি মৰম পোৱা বাবে মই মুম্বাইত গৈ কাম কৰিবলৈ সাহস পাইছিল সেইটো উৎসাহ পাইছিলোঁ তাৰপিছত যেতিয়া আমি ফ্ৰান্সলৈ আহিলোঁ ব্লগ বনোৱাৰ কথা প্লেন কৰিলোঁ তেতিয়া মোক যিহেতু আমাৰ ফ্ৰেণ্ডছবিলাক এতিয়া গ্ল'বেলি আছে সবেই আমাক কয় যে ইংলিছত বনোৱা বা হিন্দীত বনোৱা কিন্তু মোৰ প্ৰথম কথাটো আছিলে যে আমি অসমীয়াত বনাম কাৰণ অসমৰ ৰাইজৰ পৰা মই যিমান বেছি মৰম পাইছোঁ সেইকাৰণে যিমানবিলাক ব্লগছ বনাম যিমানবিলাক ঠাই মই ভিজিট কৰিম সকলোতে মোৰ অসমৰ ৰাইজক মোৰ লগত লৈ যাবলৈ মোৰ এটা ইচ্ছা আৰু সেই গোটেই হ'ল প্ৰচেছটো অসমীয়া চলচিত্ৰৰ পৰা মুম্বাই আৰু ফ্ৰান্সৰ এই ব্লগিঙৰ জাৰ্ণি গোটেই হ'ল জাৰ্ণিটোত এজন মানুহে মোক কণ্টিনিউৱাছলি ছাপোৰ্ট কৰি আছিলে আৰু তেখেতো কোনো ধৰণে কম নহয় তেখেত এয়াৰবাছ ফ্ৰান্সৰ এৰ'নটিকেল ইঞ্জিনিয়াৰে নহয় তেখেত অসমৰ একমাত্ৰ যোনে নেকি এয়াৰবাছ ইণ্টাৰনেশ্যনেল গ্ৰেজুৱেট প্ৰগ্ৰেমত গোটেই পৃথিৱীৰ ভিতৰত যোনটো নেকি বাছনি হয় তাত বাইছজনমান কেণ্ডিডেট ছিলেক্ট কৰে তাৰ ভিতৰত তেখেত এজন হয় আৰু একমাত্ৰ অসমীয়া হয় আজি মই যিটো জেগাত আহিছোঁ সেই জেগাটো মই নহয় আপোনালোককো দেখাবৰ বাবে যদি সক্ষম হ'ব আৰু আমাৰ ইয়াত শ্বুট কৰিবলৈ আমাক এলাও কৰিলে একমাত্ৰ সেইজন ব্যক্তিৰ বাবে আৰু হি ইজ নান আদাৰ দেন ওৱান্স এগেইন মাই বেষ্ট ফ্ৰেণ্ড মাই হাজবেণ্ড হেল্ল' নমস্কাৰ বঞ্জুৰ থেংক ইউ মিস্কা মোৰ বিষয়ে ইমান কোৱাৰ কাৰণে কিন্তু মিস্কাৰ বহুত কণ্ট্ৰিবিউশ্যন আছে মই আজি য'ত আছোঁ থেংক ইউ শ্ব' মাছ ফৰ বিং শ্ব' ছাপৰ্টিভ থ্ৰু আউট মাই জাৰ্ণি চ' আজি আমি আছোঁ এটা স্পেচিয়েল জেগাত ৱেৰ দ্য এৰ'নটিকেল এডভান্সমেণ্টছ এণ্ড ইটছ হিষ্ট্ৰি ইজ প্ৰিজাৰ্ভ দিছ প্লেচ ইজ ইন টুলুজ এণ্ড ইট ইজ কল এৰোস্কোপিয়া মিউজে এৰ'নটিক Many centuries have passed since the first powered aircraft built by Clemmore there in 1890 in Toulouse and the world's largest aircraft which was built by Airbus which is A380 and it flew for the first time in Toulouse and then in 1959 the first French jetliner was the first narrow body aircraft flew from Toulouse and also Concorde in 1969 it flew from Toulouse These aircraft were followed by the entire Airbus family affirming Toulouse's mission to fly higher, faster and further in this birthplace of global civil and military aviation. For more than 30 years, the players and witnesses of this industrial, technical and human saga and also the aviation lovers have strived for this history to be forever remembered and shared. Thus, Aeroscopia Museum was built to preserve this historical heritage. Let us show you the Super Guppy aircraft. Let's go. Super Guppy is a large wide-bodied cargo aircraft that is used for hauling outsized cargo components built by Aero Space Lines. It was built in 1960s and it remains a 1960s aircraft without any modern electronics. But Mishka, do you know, in the early 1970s, two Super Guppy aircrafts were used by Airbus to carry the aircraft components for assembly in their base in Toulouse. Mm -hmm. However, later on, Airbus built their own cargo plane which is called Beluga, a design similar to the Guppy. Amazing. Though Super Guppy it may be old, awkward, and even a little bit ridiculous, but the Super Guppy remains an irreplaceable baddest flying warehouse. Now let me take you to Concorde. A plane kon dekhi sene? What a different structure it have. So this was the world's fastest aircraft ever built. It's magnificent. Concorde was jointly developed and manufactured by Sud Aviation and British Aircraft Corporation which operated from 1976 until 2003. It had a maximum speed over twice the speed of sound or 2180 kilometers per hour. This is the cockpit. 
keine Kirsche. <lacht> What are this? Kiman Prona hoy. Kiman Prona kun bhi aro hoy. Ekhon tomar first uh, fly hoy sila 1969. 69 oh. Wow. Oh my God, look at this, Papa. It was in Concord where some of the elite passengers were crossing the Atlantic from London to New York in under three and a half hours. And Concord was extremely small, only about 100 seats. It had more like office chairs, bucket seats and very small windows. By end of 1976, social pressure over concerns with the plane's noise and sonic boom led to the cancellation of virtually all orders for Concorde. The plane suffered its only accident in July 2000 when an Air France Concorde crashed just after takeoff from Paris, killing all 109 people on board and four on the ground. By 2001, increasing operating and overhaul costs could not allow Concorde to fly again. This is Concorde aircraft. This is the A300B aircraft. This is the Airbus aircraft. In 1970s, several leading European companies joined forces to form the Airbus Industry Consortium with the aim of challenging the supremacy of the American aerospace giants. And then Airbus built world's first twin-engined wide-body aircrafts with a capacity of 300 seats. The A300B was the first large passenger jet with just two engines rather than three or four on contemporary designs, allowing Airbus to offer significant savings in operating costs compared to other aircraft of similar size. Airbus also became the first manufacturer to use composite materials on its aircraft, allowing major weight savings. So we are standing in front of a plane, its name called Molenaire Solnier and it was built by Raymond Solnier in 1912. This plane was used in World War I and II. You won't believe that this aircraft, the wing of it, it is a wooden structure and with fabric covering. Incredible.
So, I am going to show you the Nikon special plane. Nikon is not a plane, but it became the history of aeronautical advancements in human history. This is the Airbus Military A400M. Airbus A400M is a four-engine turboprop military transport aircraft designed by Airbus Defence and Space. The A400M combines the capability to carry strategic loads with the ability to deliver even into tactical locations with small and unprepared airstrips and can also act as a fuel tanker. And this is the Concorde, which is world's fastest aircraft ever built. Or is it too already? So this is Caravelle 12. It was the first French jetliner. Yeah, like I said, I hope you all can enjoy for this. Pola khad moi mandu rahi bolle hoy kham hoyso. Moi bhavu se homer uthiya ha jitu samar ba young stars kini ma tumal ko dikhe kham se pola khda yori yaha lagya hi bolle pari se. Tumal ke jodi aerospace aeronautical engineer ba yeto sector jodi nijo profession ba nijo career banana ba bisara ekko busto aham bhav na ho ekko busto impossible na ho. Just nijo with full dedication tumal lagye puri thaki ba aru. I believe that you will get a lot of names in your life. Today, I'm going to shoot this vlog like Mr. Pola. I'm going to do something like that. Stay focused, keep dreaming, and always try to do your best. Stay focused, keep dreaming, and always try to do by this way or the other way something for the welfare of a place or a people. So, Ms. Khaya, how do you say that? I'm going to add a lot. I'm going to say that always keep trying, success will come. And Karma Kori Zok. Follow God's intent, no worry about. So that's it. That's everything for today. Be happy, stay focused, and always keep dreaming. Try at home.